Hello out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here with Death RPG. And this is the uh, this is the opening screen. Um I uh I I don't know. I don't know, man. Wow, that's pretty obnoxious. Okay, so we've got an achievement already. Um What What? What is happening? Uh, attack, I guess. What? What? Is, what is happening? Is this the game? Are we playing the game? I'm not controlling any of this, by the way. This is, I clicked that attack button, and this is what's happening. So I actually, I actually don't know. Are we supposed to click attack again, or? Okay, so there. Okay. What are. Can we. Okay, so we can click. What is that? I don't know what that means. Okay. Let's attack them, I guess. Uh. Okay. That one died. That one. Now that one's running over and he's gonna. He's gonna fight and run all the way back. That seems. Odd. Okay. Why is one of my people a pig? Why. <laughs> Why is my dude in the middle of pig? Like, why is the- why are we fighting on molten lava? What? I- like, I keep asking this- ugh. Okay, so now what? Now what do I do? I just attack. Okay, hopefully they die this time. I've had a lot of input here, and I feel like my skill should be the thing that wins the day. Not the Molten Lava, which obviously is copy-pasted, because, you you know, like, it, it's not mixed well over here. <laughs> um, okay, do I get him this time? Good job, team. What do I, oh. Uh, okay. Is it my turn to attack now? Oh, right, he's gonna move. He gets to move, okay. Seems like only one of my dudes attacks. Okay, now what do we do? Now what happens? Oh, we run on the Molten Lava some more. Okay. Let's go! <laughs> what? Okay. So he attacks as well. Okay, now, and now they attack. Okay, so one of my guys is definitely gonna die here. Because this game is real weird. Okay, and I don't actually... I don't think I could have done anything. Do you know what I mean? I feel like... I feel like I'm gonna lose, and it's not my fault. Okay, do I get to attack? No, they're gonna move again. Okay, I'm gonna attack them. Get attacked. Right. Okay, now they get to attack again. Right, I got one attack, and then they get to attack. All of them get to attack again. Right. So originally I got one attack from each of my people, and now only one of my people can attack. Oh, one of my dudes is dead. Oh, they died. They're gone. I don't get them anymore. Okay. Attack. So he doesn't attack. So even the... I, I clicked attack. What? Okay. So do I just lose then? What? My one person that did damage died, so now I now I lose. Uh, I'll leave. What? I'm gonna... Oh. I don't... Okay, there doesn't seem to be any reason to do that, though. Okay, he's gonna go there and then attack. He didn't even move. He didn't even do the one thing I asked him to do. Okay. I love this uh, real somber classical music. It's very mood setting. Um, okay. Uh, well, I'm just, I just wanna die. I just want all of my dudes to die so that I can stop. Because, okay, now is he dead? Oh no, this guy's gonna attack him as well. It's because the game doesn't even register that he's dead. Excellent programming. Game over. Great. Let's try the super boss map. Oh, I got an achievement there as well. It's not coming up. My overlay is not reading. Okay. That's fine. Oh, right. Okay. So there's a bunch of random spinning things for zero reason. And it's the same four guys. Wow. Okay. Um, nope. Um, I'm, I'm curious now. Let's look at the snow map. 
I'm getting achievements for this. You guys can't see them, but I'm getting achievements. Okay. At least this map looks like somewhere they could actually exist. Same for same five guys. Great. Uh, forest map. Give me the forest map. I just want I just want to see if it's the same four enemy guys each time, because my guess is it is. Okay. There they are again. Oh, it's six this time. That's to up the difficulty, you see. The difficulty level. And um, you can tell it's good coding because when I press escape, it immediately goes to the um, to the menu. There's no sort of check or anything. So if you... Oh, there's only three this time. Okay. No, but we're, not, we're still not playing. We're going to look at the second city map. He's made a lot of maps. Um, spent a lot of time on the maps and... Not a lot of time on literally anything else. Those gates are like 40 feet high. Okay, let's... Okay, so she got an attack. Right? So now they all get to attack as well. Okay, each one of them gets an attack. Right? Yep, they attack the only person that can attack back. Oh, they move. Okay, let's have them... Let's have them attack. Nope. Can he, he can't go over here. Let's have him run up to here. Okay, there we go. And now let's have him attack. No, it's just her again. Same one. Cool. So I can move, I can move that one. Okay, so he's gonna leave. Okay. Uh, oh, right, attack pattern. What does that, what does that even mean? So he can only attack if they're in the sp that one spot. I don't. I don't understand. None of that makes sense. Okay, but she can attack anybody, right? Right. Okay. So her attack pattern is anybody, I guess. Oh my god. Okay. So what do I do? So. If I move him to here, I see. So part of the game is trying to line them up so that they're standing on my stuff, standing on the correct stuff. Okay, and I can just move them freely, so that's fine. That works. That works out to my. So this is this is a totally pointless uh, combat mechanic, but we're gonna do it. There was a way to there was a way to get three of them on there, wasn't there? Whatever, that's fine. Let's go attack. Okay. And this guy's gonna get to attack as well. Right. We might actually beat this level because my, my I finally figured out how to do the stuff. Um, it doesn't make the game better. The game still sucks. This game is awful. Um, oh, sorry. Did I... I, uh, I might have forgotten to say I got this for free. Um, I got this for free from the developer, which I don't know why. Um, the game is bad. It's real bad. Okay, we're on to wave three. I'm going to fast forward. You guys don't need to see me trying to get through these waves of dudes. Um, because it's dumb. The whole game is dumb. So, I'm going to... I just want to get... I only want to get through the dudes for my own edification. Just to see if there is any point to any of these levels. You know what I mean? So, I'm going to do that. Okay? And you guys just sit tight and, and have a watch. <laughs> Okay, so we passed the level. Good job. Wow. Wow. Okay, well, let's go look at the description because I'm I'm done. That's terrible. Actually, legitimately awful. Let's go look to see what the the game has to say for itself. Okay, top down drag and drop RPG strategy game. Help three survivors to kill enemies in different worlds. Right, so there are multiple developers here, enough for a plus sign. Three people developed this. Okay. Um, published by Terralunka. Now, I feel like I've heard that name before. Um, let's see, they've, got, they've done some updates. Seventh level added and also added, for now, easy achievements, which are very easy to get. Great. 
Um, play player have three different characters in every level with different skills, abilities, and attack patterns. Uh, okay, drag and drop player units on the grid with mouse, move characters to desired slots, and press attack button. Then every attack happens automatically after player have make all his moves, shift turns to AI opponent. Player can continue as long as at least one of his characters are alive. Levels contain one to four waves, and last wave contain boss. After boss is death, level are completed. Oh, uh, after boss is dead. Okay, I got it. Only last wave will contain bosses, so use your brains and just mouse to beat enemies. Right. Uh, Pig Warrior, most powerful player character with double damage. Gangsta Mage. And a Woman Mage. I feel like I'm playing Hero Quest again, where you have, like, Barbarian, uh, Mage, Dwarf, and... What's the other? Warrior, you know? It's just like a mix of just random words. Police enemies in every waves. Different bosses in end of levels. Green zombie boss with double damage ability. Red cyborg boss with ability to spawn rocks to attack grid. Seven levels. Easy steam achievements. Plan features more different bosses. This game is bad. Wow. It's just straight up terrible. Um, okay, let's have a look at... What is this? Valkea Software Bundle. Ooh, well, we better have a look at that. Better see what's in that thing, because I'm guessing it's some amazing stuff. I feel like we played Labyrinth Escape. I don't remember, though. Inferno Puzzle. No. Go-Kart Survival. Cyborg Invasion Shooter. I mean, you, you look at the... Cyborg Invasion Shooter 2. Excellent. Um, you look at the the actual thumbnails for their games, and based on that, you can tell how much uh, they put into the actual game. This game actually looks like it has some effort put in because it's got, you know, a reasonable... They, there's some design there. Someone actually spent some time. This is just... Yeah. Oh, that one's just called Horror. Oh, Lawnmower Game 3 Horror. Death RPG. Wow. Okay. Just... And $53, it's a steal. Wow. Okay. Um, let's have a look at Terra Lunka because... Yeah, they're charging $1.29. And, like, honestly, that is too much. $1.29 is too much to be charging for this game. Just saying. Um, yeah, I feel like I've heard of Terra Lunka before. Um, Super President, How to Rule the Country. Uh, okay. Well, nope. Run, Naked Woman, Run. Right. Uh, Gangsta Sniper, Pixel Robot Hunter. Okay. Well, I am at a loss as to why they would give this game away for free to people to do reviews, but I guess they did get one review out of it. Um, nice little puzzle game. This person has 13,000 products in their account. Excellent. Um... Sadly, there is no story, just few levels. Graphics and sound are okay, but nothing more. It is difficult to explain the gameplay, so please watch the video below. For the low price, it is okay, but do not expect something awesome. Why would you... Okay. Um, I thought the game looked cool. When? Where Where did you think that it looked cool? You got it for free, right? Um, they said more will be added in two, three weeks. Yeah, everyone has the exact same attack and death animation. Great. No tutorial, zero explanation of the game at all. Yeah, it's bad. It's so bad. Very good puzzle and RPG strategy game. Can't wait for the updates. Uh, okay, obvious plant. Great. Love it. Um, this game is bad. Don't buy this game. Uh, I would probably stay away from most of the things. Check out the entire Terralunka Games franchise on Steam. Yeah, so we did that. Yeah, we looked at this. We already looked at this. Okay, well, I'm going to leave it there. That's Death RPG, which is neither deathy nor RPG. It's just kind of terrible to look at, terrible to play, and not a good time for anybody. So, uh, thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Class dismissed.